I'm author illustrator Gemma Denham. Today I'm going to show you how to make exploding books. To make your exploding book you will need three pieces of paper cut into a square. I've used some pieces of A4 that I've cut down into a 21 centimetre square. You will also need a glue stick and you may need some pieces of card if you're making a cover for your book. Take a piece of square paper and fold it in half like so. Open it out and then fold it in half the other way. Try and keep everything as square as possible. And open it out. Then I'm going to turn it upside down and I'm going to fold on the diagonal. Like so. Push down in the middle. Bring those pieces up and all the corners together. That it makes your first page. of your book. Repeat this step for the other two pieces of paper. When you've got all three of your pages folded, it's time to stick them together. So you open one out with a glue stick. Just glue one of the squares. And this sticks in an opposite way. So if this one is the open one, open, flip that one over, and that will stick in the opposite way. Try and line it up as exact as you can. And it should all fold up like so. And do the same for the last page. So, on the sort of inner side of your paper, glue the square. Because we've glued the inner side of that one, we stick it to the reverse side of this one. And then fold it up. inside of your exploding book. Now we've used three sheets there. You could always make it bigger and add more pieces of paper. And then if you like, you can make a cover to go on top of that. To make a cover for your book, you will need two pieces of square card. These want to be about one centimetre bigger than your square pages. And you can use a glue stick for this or some double sided tape. Get a good covering of glue onto your paper. And stick it centrally onto your card. And again on this side for the other cover. Give 
your book. A colourful cover. You could always print or draw a design on here. You could always cover your card in colourful paper. And here are some other designs that I've done. You can always print out your own book cover design and then all that's left to do is to fill it with your story and these work very well in a comic strip style or you could just use them as sketchbooks. <laughs> 